Hello. Yeah. This is a uh, an, an anaesthetised patient who is having uh, a laparoscopy. Uh, who has given us consent for us to video the insertion of the tube of airway. The tube of airway is a cheap, disposable, one size fits all superglottic airway. The patient is now anaesthetized and in a suitable condition or state to have uh, superglottic airway inserted. The superglottic airway comes inflated with about 40 mils. It's inserted uh, with or without help from the operating department practitioner in the midline and is inserted until the tongue it passes the tongue, the posterior aspect of the tongue when insertion is stopped, so it's inserted similar to a Vidal airway. The airway, I'm now hand ventilating the patient. On this occasion I don't need, there's a small leak but I have quite a high airway pressure on and the person is easy to hand ventilate and there's no problems. I think if we put another 10 mils into that cuff please just to stop any more potential leak. Thank you, that's 10 mils. The airway pressure I've got is at 14 centimetre of water maximum with a mean of five centimetres of water and I've got a normal carbon dioxide trace which is unobstructed. If I put her on a ventilator and let her ventilate we have no leak We've got a tidal volume of 500 mils and we've got a mean airway pressure there of 6 and a normal capnograph trace just slightly high. Cap if I can just bring that down. Turn the anaesthetic agent down to 2%. So this airway now is inserted safely and correctly and easily. I need to secure it for these. The reason I secure it is to ensure that it doesn't come out. And uh, that's all this. <laughs> so that's secured. If I turn her head to the left, No problems. If I turn it to the right, I still have an airway. No problems. I put her back into what I would call a neutral position. The airway is fine. So this airway now is inserted and I hope gives a demonstration of a simple airway being, in, uh, being inserted into the patient providing an adequate, adequate airway.